All right, now let's move into the full 3D world here with 3D scan to design inspections. Uh, this again is where RealWorks has some really nice features and strong suits where you can do object inspection, cloud to surface inspection, and then supporting true 3D meshes there. You can see in the upper right corner um, a mesh a model of that uh, statue. Jason, do you know where that statue is? I'm sorry if I'm showing my ignorance here. Um, do you have any background yes. on that? Actually, the uh, front of the uh, HMS Surprise uh, ship uh, was used in the movie Master and Commander. So it... ah, okay, cool. Thank you. Um, the uh, inspection routines, um, RealWorks can compare objects in both 2D and 3D. The objects can be surfaces, meshes, point clouds, or complex geometries. This can be particularly useful for comparing changes uh, you know, when you're talking about design, you know, you've got a, a design model and you're, you've scanned it and you want to compare it to the uh, point cloud, you know, an as-built uh, reflection of, of what was built in the field. Um, taking this a step further, similar to the 2.5D, but now in full 3D, RealWorks allows users to create an inspection map between a cloud and a surface to see the differences. Um, there you see some of those heat maps, um, particularly useful. We'll talk about tunneling specifically later, but for tunneling uh, as well, they're shown in that that uh, lower right screenshot where you're taking the the um, uh, design and comparing it to the cloud. And then RealWorks uh, uses uh, treats meshes and surfaces almost as the same thing, but RealWorks allows, where, where TBC can do the edits on the 2.5D surfaces, RealWorks can do the edits on the full 3D meshes. So being able to create and edit mesh surfaces by using both projection and non-projection based methods, you know, like the unfolding um, uh, of a cylinder, you know, to, to get a tank, pick up a tank, or create, uh, using a vertical plane to use as the basis for your projection to pick up some vertical features, um, you know, taking really getting that that uh, full 3D dimension. Anything else there to add, experts? Yeah, just on RealWorks, so we we do the inspection maps. That's where you get the projection between the two surfaces. Uh, mm -hmm. But well, also there's a the 3D specifically called the 3D inspection tool which will allow you to go and take pretty complex shapes, such as a building, for example. Uh, maybe you've got a design model, and then you wanna compare it to the as-built point cloud. And then you can set tolerances on, on the, the colors you want to use. I think down in the lower left, you can see uh, an example of setting a, a color, uh, color bar to see where there's deviation. So you could set a one range as one color, and another range as a different color, then to go in and highlight and see where things are off and, and how much they're off. Great, thank you, Jason. That's the slide, here we go. Um, some further resources to learn more about 3D inspections in Trimble RealWorks.